What's going on everyone? This is Travis Sets Fire and welcome back to TMP Limitless 3. Now you're probably asking yourself, wow, why do you look so different? Well, I'm wearing some new armor that I crafted, but apparently I don't know how to press the record button. So uh, yeah, we missed all that uh, and missed all this. <laughs> so I, this is... This is steel armor. I made it using the basic crusher to make, you know, crushed coal in iron and that coal, crushed coal in the alloy smelter to make steel. So there's that. And also all these chests here are full of crops because what I did was made these basic logistical transporters. And in order to do that, I had to make the metallurgic infuser for mechanism. So you have to make these basic control circuits. And that is redstone and osmium ingot. And that's how you get that. And then you make two steel and that to get eight logistic transports. So I went and... So last time we made a, f a couple of those ender hoppers and regular hoppers so i put the hoppers here under the ender hoppers put a barrel under them hooked up the logistical transports and now every time the harvester the, every time the harvester harvests the ender hopper sucks them up and as you can see right now perfect timing it just pulls them up whoop, it pulls them all in and they all go into these chests i don't have them I don't have a sorting system yet, I don't have refined storage going yet, but it's it's a work in progress. So they but they do stack. Like they're if if the seed or crop isn't in the top chest, it goes into the bottom one here. And once this one's full, then they'll start going down into here and so on and so forth. So I do have quite a bit of time uh, to figure something out before it gets too full. So we'll just fix this and this. So this is actually kind of a blessing in disguise that I wasn't recording because now it gives me more time to do what I wanted to do. <laughs> and that is to get more into mechanism. So I want to make a biogenerator and a mechanism, a mechanism crusher because that is how you get the fuel for the biogenerator. So you just put, you know, seeds or what have you in the crusher, and that's how you get the biofuel, and that's what gives you fuel for the biogenerator. So basically I should have like a limitless supply of fuel. So let's get to that. So we'll start with the crusher first. So we need a steel casing, which is four steel, glass, and osmium. This is still going. So while that's going, I'll make some more of those control things. So we'll put the redstone in, and then the osmium, and that's how we get these. We're going to need a bunch. I'm just going to make a bunch, and two buckets of lava. All right, we got our lava. Let's zip on back to the base. All right, these are done. Now we're just gonna. Now we're just waiting on the steel. Okay, we got our steel. Oh, we're gonna need glass. casing and <laughs> four redstone and there we have our crusher so what I'm thinking is probably putting
it here. We'll put the crusher here. It's, it doesn't have power right now, but it, that's okay. I'm going to be doing a little uh, reworking here. Actually, you know what? I should have some power cable somewhere. Aha! Basic universal cables. Alright, so that's got power. And let's start making, hopefully, hopefully these modded seeds work. Ah, they don't. That sucks. Alright, so it looks like I'm going to have to make a, a wheat field. That's alright, it gives me an excuse to work on the next tier of my greenhouse. So that's doing that, it's going to make biofuel. Okay, we got everything we need for the bio generator. Now this should automatically pull. Oh no, it's backwards. Don't want that. Okay, let's, uh, let's see here. We'll get rid of this for now. And I did make a configurator. Oh no. Am I going to have to go in through the bottom? Um, crap! I don't remember how to get the fuel into there. I don't think... I don't think mechanism has like a universal like it transports energy and power. Um I guess I'm gonna have to just go with a a hopper. I'll have to put this up here. It's gonna look kinda ugly. Let's see what they have for hoppers. They have fast hoppers, speedy hopper. Hopefully this works. OK, 
Okay, Speedy Hopper 1. Speedy Hopper 2. Aha! We'll put the crusher on top. And we'll put some more seeds in it and see if it see if it works. Okay, we have to do this. There it goes. Now it's working. Yep, there it's working. Okay. Awesome. It's working. Woohoo! Cool. So we basically have once I get my greenhouse going, we will have unlimited power. No more coal generator. Awesome. I'm going to do a little cleaning up of my inventory, and then I will bring you back to work on this greenhouse again. Okay, new plan. I'm going to make a separate greenhouse just for the wheat. Okay, so I think we are going to be wrapping it up here in just a second. I ran back to the desert because I ran out of glass. So I went and got sand. But I think we're going to make this guy real, real quick before we call it a day. It's the smelter. So we need glass. Basically, everything. <laughs> okay, so while that's doing that, I will make... This... Casing... Okay, so got the casing, and... Should have enough left over to make the rest of it. There. Now I just need power. And this is really loud. So I do need to make the the quiet upgrade thing for it. I don't know why it's so loud. That's just crazy. But yeah, that'll do its thing. It'll make glass. And while that's doing that, I'm gonna still work on getting all the, the wheat grown in here. So I'll be doing a little bit of stuff off cam. Not a whole lot, but you know, enough. It was a pretty productive day. Got all these set up. I was actually recording this time, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm excited to get this get this greenhouse get these greenhouses done. The main reason I wanted to get the greenhouses done so quickly is because I wanted to use this bio generator. Uh, so I mean, like it's basically an infinite fuel source. I mean, it doesn't put out that much, but you know, for starting out, it's it's a it's a good generator to have starting out. You know, obviously as I get more and more machines and I upgrade them so they take up more power, then I'm going to have to upgrade. 
uh, to something else, and I'm thinking of doing another extreme reactor. <laughs> I saw that mod was in here, and I about fell out of my chair out of excitement. So, I'm excited. I'm excited about all this still. So yeah, if you enjoyed that video, why don't you give it a thumbs up and share it with everyone. And yeah, I know, you can't see my eyes with this helmet. I, it's okay. It's fine. And yeah, subscribe if you're not subscribed. And uh, don't forget to join my Discord. Uh, link in description. Uh, I post all my stream alerts and videos in there. Because, uh, you know, YouTube still isn't recommending all my stuff yet. But I'm working on it. My name is Travis That's Fire. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you next time.